EFNN, The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Wednesday, the 2nd of October. The Dow is down 40 at 42,117. The 42,628 high of four sessions ago appears to be at least a short-term top based on Chapman Wave methodology. But we haven't got a big pullback until the Dow actually closes under 41,800. This is still a work in progress, so it's holding pretty well. It's actually one of the stronger indices because if you look at the S&P, the S&P now is down uh, 13 at 56.94. It is making lower lows for the past few days, and it made that particular technique that I'd call a peak C1, C2. It's like a double top, and it is pulling back, but that 9, like the Dow, 914 is still very strong, but the MACD turned negative. Uh, stochastic still very good at 88%. QQQ, almost the same thing. QQQ is down $1.35 at 479.97. Hasn't taken out yesterday's low, but it has been weaker with lower highs for the last uh, four sessions. And that was a peak D. That's where you get a little cautious. And we're going to the IWM, which has been much weaker. And uh, today it's down 36 cents at 217.60, uh, uh, 271.51. Actually, it's holding quite nicely, but the the chart itself is not looking that great. Now, let's go to gold. Gold, and I was mentioning this the other day, gold looked to me like if it wasn't for the uh, Middle East conflagration, it would, in fact, be uh, starting to pull back a little bit more, but it's holding well. It's down just nine right now. It was down much more earlier on over the last few days, making... Uh, slightly higher lows since the what's today Monday low, so this is acting quite well. Let's go to the um, bonds, and this is really the story for me. Look at that down over over a point, one point and seven thirty seconds, at one twenty three and twenty six thirty seconds, right on this trend line that I drew in quite some time ago. If it takes that out, if it starts to go to the one twenty two uh, and five thirty second area, oh, that's a problem. Ah, oh, crude oil is having a big move. It's up uh, 2.37 to 72.19. Not fantastic, but it is moving very well since it made a 64 low. I'll be back with the Titan Technicians Hour. This is a very important moment in the marketplace. It's trying to assess the uh, political aspect. It's trying to assess the strikes. It's trying to assess a lot of things going on. Middle East 